So my name is Wei Chen. Uh, I am a civic engagement director with Asian Americans United. Yeah, I've been working here for 10 years. I started as a youth uh, coordinator, uh, organizing young people and civic engagement work, like getting people out to vote. So I talk to a lot of younger generation people and older generation people about their concern of the community, about their uh, how they want to vision about this country, this city, and this state. Asian American United is uh, one of a, a non-profit organization based in Philadelphia uh, for uh, about 37 years, started in 1985. So our mission is about uh, creating leadership and uh, building a community and fight against oppression. Fighting against oppression and protecting our culture is very significant, especially in the United States. This is the most diverse country. This is a country that does not have an original culture. It's the culture that put together by the immigrant and the migrant and the people who come to this country. So we it bring me a lot. I was very shocked that the whole process did not go through a conversation and just announce it. They want to be a good neighbor for us. Which, you know, when they say, well, every time when they say they want to be a good neighbor for us, it makes me more angry. Because a good neighbor, it wasn't like, looking like that. I want to give you a surprise. And, and we, as a, um, as a people who from this community, work in this community, come to community every single day and know more than them about this community, we have a bigger concern. And, and more concerned than them. We are thinking bigger than like, you know, individual. We are thinking about whole Chinatown, whole community. We are worried about in the future, we will not be able to host our community celebration anymore because the arena, they're going to prioritize their uh, event, not ours event. If people are not celebrating in Chinatown, they will not come to Chinatown. Like our Chinatown will, get disappear, will disappear. We are door by door knocking the Chinatown business owner as their permission, putting out, uh, putting out the uh, sign, say no arena in Chinatown. And many uh, business owners accept the uh, poster. I'm 42 years in here in Chinatown, and I live in Chinatown too. Now just work, all my business in Chinatown, and I work in Chinatown, my business in Chinatown, and then I, I see the Chinatown grow for the past 40 years. So I'm a small fan. But keep where you are. Don't come with my town, destroy my town, peace. I said, well, don't destroy our culture here, okay? We're living here, we're we happy here. Hey, you get money, you can build somewhere else. 20 years ago, it's a stadium come around, we defeat, and now I'm old. I'm retired age now, I'm 65 years old, and then I gotta fight this uh, arena again. It's very hard now, that's, that, that's that. very hard for the. We try, we try to hold the community together and defeat this project. And now go see it now. Chinatown has been 150 years in now. We can keep the culture going forever. It can be, can be destroyed. I think we learned it from uh, we, in history, we learned from uh, in DC, that destroyed the DC Chinatown. But we don't want to happen here. Okay. And first thing is it's, that we know here should be destroyed the whole community. When you go to DC Chinatown, you can see a, a pretty, a shiny Chinatown, but without the spirit, without the body of a Chinatown anymore, because no one, no, none of the Chinese is living there. The only thing city government did, uh, the DC government did to protect Chinatown is force the business to putting a Chinese sign out, even though they don't serve Chinese customers anymore. Philadelphia Chinatown is a one of a community. We still have a spirit. We still have a body. People still living here, shopping here, celebrating their culture here, and, uh, and gathering their family member here. Such like, you know, um, in Cantonese culture, we have a dim sum. Like, you know, family comes here once a week, or once a month, to, uh, to get together with each other, chatting about, uh, talk to each other about the family, about the war. Uh, with the celebrate uh, sar with the food.
non-Asian, non-Chinese people, you still can say a lot of words by uh, reposting in your social media. Motivize them to come to Chinatown, uh, support us. And also comment to the 76er post about their proposal. The gentrification happened to Chinatown is very, very sad for me. And we do not want that gentrification. We do not want that any kind of big proposal development development like to gentrify Chinatown. We welcome the development from the community, but not from the developer and the billionaire who want to make money. Uh, long, uh, Chinese people or Asian people can be a, a strong ally for us. Tell to our politician, tell to our, tell to our city council member, they have a decision to make to save a community or to damage or destroy a community.